Hello everyone, today we will speak about asphalt segregation. Asphalt segregation means that the asphalt is not homogeneous in its texture. This can cause a shorter lifetime due to fast exodization and raveling. While it looks like the team is making an effort to place the asphalt properly after the finish shell, they are actually trying to fix the segregation caused by the finish shell. The texture that we will get will not look like this, shiny and uniform, but it will look like this. The coarse aggregates will be sunken but not properly embedded in the upper layer. They will be the first to pop out. This is also segregation. Look again at the team's work and watch closely for these aggregates. Thank you for listening so far and you are welcome to press the subscribe button and even the notification bell. You can email me and write a remark as well. It is mainly important to pay attention to this segregation in areas where we have parking lots or an operative area that involves the traffic of forklifts or trucks. In these places, the most powerful shear stresses will apply on the upper surface, causing the aggregates to be pulled out and will get a very ugly texture. We can sew out a piece of the asphalt on site and after extracting the bitumen, we can trace the aggregates gradation line. By comparing it to the factory original line limits, we can see and calculate the differences in every sieve and determine the exact amount of segregation. Thank you for listening. Tell me what kind of videos would you like to see and you can write me a remark. See you next time. Bye.